The endocannabinoid system is one of the main neuromodulatory systems acting in the central nervous system and is highly conserved across species. Endocannabinoids exert major control over neuronal activity by activating cannabinoid receptors. The endocannabinoid-mediated plasticity mechanisms are found at both excitatory and inhibitory synapses in most brain areas. They primarily depend on a postsynaptic release of endocannabinoids and the retrograde activation of presynaptically located cannabinoid receptors type 1, which are abundantly expressed in most cell types. In contrast to the well-established function and localization of cannabinoid receptor type 1, little is known about the role of cannabinoid receptor type 2 in basic neurotransmission. Indeed, until recently, the cannabinoid receptor type 2 was referred to as the peripheral cannabinoid receptor, where it participates in the regulation of immune responses and was responsible for the anti-inflammatory effects of cannabis. In the hippocampus, the presence of cannabinoid receptors type 2 has been suggested, but their physiological role is uncertain. Furthermore, it is not clear whether they are expressed neuronally or mainly in cells of the immune system, such as microglia. In this paper, we find that action potential driven endocannabinoid release leads to a long lasting membrane potential hyperpolarization in hippocampal principal cells that is independent of cannabinoid receptor type 1. The hyperpolarization, which is specific to CA3 and CA2 pyramidal cells, depends on the activation of neuronal cannabinoid receptors type 2, as shown by a combined pharmacogenetic and immunohistochemical approach. Upon activation, they modulate the activity of the sodium bicarbonate cotransporter leading to a hyperpolarization of the neuron. Cannabinoid receptors type 2 activation occurred in a purely self-regulatory manner, robustly altered the input-output function of CA3 pyramidal cells and modulated gamma oscillations in vivo. By providing a first description of functional neuronally expressed cannabinoid receptor type 2 in area CA3 of the hippocampus, our findings now reveal a novel role for cannabinoid receptor type 2 in the central nervous system. They challenge the classic cannabinoid receptor type 1 focused view on endocannabinoid function. Functional cannabinoid receptor type 2 is expressed in hippocampal principal neurons. Upon its activation, it mediates a long-lasting cell-intrinsic hyperpolarization in principal neurons of areas CA3 and CA2. The activation of neuronal cannabinoid receptor type 2 modulates the excitability of CA3 pyramidal cells in vitro and also alters locally generated gamma oscillations in vivo. Our results provide, to our knowledge, a first in-depth description of neuronal cannabinoid receptor type 2 expression and its functional relevance in the hippocampus.